The idea is like, I never know where is the limit between using the language of people who understand, who, who read what I'm doing or listen to what I'm doing versus use the knowledge I have to educate people. So to teach them new kind of uh, language and verbs concepts. and language, like for example, the flow state, many people in the art business, they don't know what it is. It's really using sports psychology. So I would like to teach them not to use another word like go in the zone or something else. So I don't know if it's useful for marketing or how to manage that. Really good question. Essentially, how much jargon should we use in our con and of course, we need to divide between free content and paid content. Uh, <laughs> when in your paid content, people who are already buying something from you or hiring you, you can lean more heavily into the industry specific knowledge and concepts because that's what they paid for. They're paying for to go more advanced. But in the free content, you should always uh, gear yourself towards beginners in the <laughs> free content. In any industry, there are always many more beginners than there are intermediates and more intermediates than there are advanced people. I mean, I, I can't give you a percentage, but I, I'm going to say probably, and, and here's the thing, like even, so like 80% of your content should be beginner, free content, free content, um, social media yeah. stuff should be beginner stuff. You should not use any jargon, or if you use jargon, you should define it each time, each time. Okay. Yeah. And it, your definition can be really short flow state by which I mean, blah, 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 is blah, blah, blah. You can keep going. If you, especially if you keep using a, a particular industry specific word uh, and over time, over time, over time, your audience will start getting used to it. And essentially your whole audience starts becoming more intermediate from beginner. Mm -hmm. But you, even though your, your whole audience becomes more intermediate, you're still going to get the inflow of beginners always, always, always. And even the intermediate and advanced people still enjoy reading beginner material if it's free. Free material always cater to beginners. Whenever I would say 80% of the time cater to beginners and 20% of the time cater to intermediates. And then you might sprinkle in a little bit of advanced concepts every now and then just to test whether they, they get it. Does that make sense? Yes, perfect. Thank you. Yes. What I'm doing now is like when I write articles that are a bit longer, I take the time to explain some of the content, Good. some of these words. Yes. Otherwise, yes. if it's, you know, really graphical and immediate, use easy language, simple language. Okay. Right. Exactly. Yes, exactly. Articles, you have more time to explain and uh, people appreciate it. You know, like I said, I have read a whole book on flow. Uh, you know, I've, I've read a, a book on flow as applied to business or whatever anyway. And, but still today, if you wrote something that explained flow, defined flow in your terms, I would enjoy reading that. In mm -hmm. fact, it's almost like the more advanced someone is, the more they even enjoy or geek out on another practitioner defining beginner, beginner terms. It's kind of like, I always say in uh, like a martial arts class, let's say, you know, you're learning Kung Fu or something like that. Uh, you will find that even in the white belt classes, the advanced people are still learning. The, they're still practicing along the white belt people how to punch. That's the most beginner thing you can do in a martial arts class, how to do this. But the advanced people are learning it with more nuance. They understand the history of the punch. They understand how these muscles all work together and they understand how they, anyway. but beginners are just trying not to hurt themselves and just trying to understand what a punch is. Whereas, if it, you know, so it always is welcome to do beginner content. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you.